Hello everybody, this is Cycle, and we are going to do a let's play of a game called Magi Nation. Magi Nation was an RPG for the Game Boy Color that was a really big part of my childhood. I really loved it, and I haven't played it or looked at anything really from it for the past, like, uh, 10 years or so, so I'm really uh, excited about this. There's also a card game that was very cool and really awesome. So this is the uh, the main menu when we press press start and we get into the game. We have new game, new game plus, and continue. So we are going to make a new game. Of course this is a uh, this is a Game Boy Color game so the uh, text boxes are really uh, small and cramped on the bottom. So 5.32 p.m. on a Tuesday in Tavel Gorge. Dude, this place is not safe. It's fine. What's so bad about it? If it's so safe, why don't you go in there? Hey, don't change the subject. You're the one who's supposed to go in. No way. Fine, let's get Benny to do it. Yeah, he'll do anything. Hey, Benny, wanna go in the cave? No way, I'm not going in there. Ha 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 ha. You got sold by your little brother. Shut up. What's up, guys? I'm just gonna use like almost my normal voice for Tony, who's the main character, because uh, who the heck are you? My name's Tony, Tony Jones. I moved here a few days ago. Who are you? Ha! Huh, did you hear that, Sly? Yeah, what a stupid name. Phony Bones is more like it. No, it's Tony Jones. You don't like your new name? Deal. Hey, Josh, come here. Whisper, whisper. Okay, phony. If you don't like your new name, you'll have to earn back your old one. Whatever. How? Go in this cave and get us a crystal. Of course, if you're too chicken. Fine. I'll be back shortly. Ooh, phony's a tough guy. Phony bony. <laughs> well, I guess I'd better get this over with. All right. So now we're in the game. Um, we're Tony Jones. We're always going to be Tony Jones, and uh, by the way, the music, I really love the music in this game. It's a shame that this game wasn't really uh, popular, because, oh, I can run. Uh, let's see, was it down? To find. Uh, because the music was so good and everything was so good about this game, uh, I really enjoyed it. Now, I'm paying attention, I did play this before, so there's some spoilers about it. I paid attention to the route that I took because the route that you take uh, affects some stuff so you have to get out of here pretty quick. Um, I'm not going to trace back too quick but I just wanted to make sure I had it in my head when I was going to do it. So we're going to go up here, we're going to run 100% of the time and we're going to get this crystal. Got it! Oh no, I've got to get out of here. Go Tony, go! Oh, I just luckily went the wrong right way. Listen to that music. Oh no! Okay, I didn't remember clearly. Oh! Do you hear something? What's going on? Oh. I guess it had its own splash effect, but uh. Mergle, mergle. Blev work! There's no way, by the way, that I'm gonna get these voices consistent throughout the whole game, so you're just gonna have to deal with me improving the whole thing. Mergle, merk, 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 merk. Blarg, blarg, a block! Link. Blarg! God, I love the music in this game. Wark or Gaboo? More of Wakamoo. Yargamoo. What the? Morph? Mungamung. Where the heck is this? Gagak. Weeg. <laughs> okay, let me talk to Roy. What's the? And we just witnessed our first battle in the whole game. 
Oh, thank God, a human. Exploding sock puppet. What? I don't understand you. Taxi apple sponge. What language are you speaking? I should try to do an old, older guy voice. Skunks playing poker. Basketball cheesesteak. I think he's crazy. Actually, I don't think he's that old. I mean, whatever. Two words. Three syllables. Sounds like bird. No, wait. Plane? Dirigible fork. He gives Tony a bracelet. Put it on? Did it work? Hey, I can understand you now. Whew, finally. That was getting silly. You can already tell the inconsistency in the voices. Okay, my name is Aiden. I'm Tony. Tony, I saw how you handled yourself against those fiends back there. May I see the ring you just used to call that creature? Ring? You don't have a ring? What's that on the ground? This crystal? You use that to summon the creature? I don't know. I have no idea what's happening here. I've never seen anything like this. You're not from around here, are you? I'm from Tavel Gorge. Do you know how I can get back? Tavel Gorge? Never heard of it. The world is truly vast. Well, if you don't know your own way back, I'm sure Orwin could tell you. He's the elder of Vashnaroon. Come, I'll take you there. Okay. So this is really cool. Now we're in our new world, and uh, we can look at some of our stuff. You can see I'm Tony. I have level one. I have no experience. Uh, over to the right uh, of Tony, there's 000, which is my money. E is energy, which I have 100 out of 100. If I select, uh, I actually can't look at anything else. So uh, there you go. I believe. Yeah. So I don't remember the names of all the areas, but I know Vashner Room is one of them. That's pretty, pretty cool. Ah. This way, Tony. So it's really nice. Instead of just throwing you um, or making you go a certain way, you're given the freedom to kind of walk around and choose the way you want. You can kind of explore, and uh, it's just kind of like, you know, whatever. You also get to control it. You get to move your guy around right away, which I really like. I love, love, love the music in this game. We're just going to go. Yeah, there we go. This is the overworld. Um... And this is where we can save the game. Hey, it's Aiden. Lower the stairs. Come, Tony. That's the entrance to the extra room. Korg, this is the perfect chance for us to get in there and cause some disarray. Shut up, Zet. I'm in charge, and I say we go in there and cause di disray. Hurry, you're the stairs, Will. No, we must not be seen. Run! Shut up, Zed. I'm in charge. Lol. Aiden? Hey, Aiden? Where'd he go? Look at this. Again, all of a sudden I can do what I want. Stairs are out, so I can't go down there. But we are in Vashna room now. It looks a little high at first, but you get used to it quickly. We're in a giant tree city. Pretty badass. RPG, you gotta talk to people. Welcome to Vashna room. I don't remember much of any of this at all. I don't remember the music being this badass either. Um, we'll do a little exploring. I'll try not to get ridiculously sidetracked, but there's a lot of a world here. Hmm. It's a bookcase. And it's empty. Wow, it took you that long? Chest. Tony got a Baloo leaf. I don't remember what this does. Items. Oh, jeez. I just recovered 10 energy, and I used up the item. I don't remember the, uh, I think it's, maybe it's select that allows you to, uh, city. Uh, select allows you to see what the items do. Some burnt books. I just love this. Um, I remember when I played it, it felt kind of like the, uh, the times of care, adopt and eat it today. It kind of felt like it was, uh, um, 
poking fun at a lot of RPGs. I don't remember the year that this came out. I think it would be 2001. Pruitt made me a pretty ring. Okay, let's go figure visit Pruitt. Hello. Are you a friend of Orwin's? Who's... Okay. Uh... Who's Orin? Oh, you're not? Orin is the elder of Ashen Room, silly. Everyone knows that. Hello, are you a friend of Orin's? Yeah, look at this RPG stuff. Yes, I am. Can't find him, huh? He lives in the northeast part of the town. Oh, there we go. I thought she was gonna do stuff for me. You better not be trying to open that door. Uh, nope, not me. Oh, I just love it. Oh, God. <laughs> uh... Lumpy. I can kind of interact with everything a little bit. Um, we're actually going to be doing that a lot because I just I want to re-explore this game. Um, we'll do the main quest too, but item shop probably. I want that chest. I don't know if this is a guy or a girl. Welcome. Now, okay, check this out. There is a there is something broken in this game. Uh, they did not balance it properly. Uh, they did not balance this game pro properly. You can buy a certain item in the game, which I believe is this strength gem, for five, uh, I can't remember what the currency is called. And you can sell it for 18, so you can go infinite money right away. It's not that big of a deal, but it, uh, it's, it's pretty sweet. These cats are weird, I remember they're freaking me out. What do you want to say? It's the same character! The inn is open even though the door is closed. The patch just to keep the Weebos from getting in this floor. Flower, yuck. Weebo is a type of monster. Um, I guess I could talk briefly about how this game works. It's kind of Pokemon-esque. I get rings to help summon guys, and they are going to help me fight guys and continue through. So, would you like to record your journey and recover lost energy? Yeah. Good night. Alright, I found the inn. Uh, it saves the game and heals me is going to be the key. So I got a Balu leaf. Let's see if I can uh, if I can figure out what this does. Actually, I already know, but... Okay, no. It doesn't tell me. We're going to have to figure out what all the items do on the fly. But first, I want to see if I can max out my money. It saves the grinding. It's pretty cool. Oops. I want to see if I can... Okay, we sold it for 8. Now we're going to buy a strength gem. And we're going to sell it. Yeah, see, look at this. Sell for 18. Isn't this beautiful? Um, oops, oops. I'm a little too eager. Um, I want to sell it all, by the way. Um, so, you know, it's like farming, but uh, a lot faster and a lot less grindy. This is always also why you should never. <laughs> if you're making a game, I want to sell all those too, and I want to buy more of these. If you're making a game, you should make sure you uh, get all these things. <laughs> don't don't let this happen. Which you know I don't I don't I've never seen a game actually do this, um, where it messes up this bad. But not having to worry about money is a really really great thing. I'm actually just going to max out, and uh, it'll be awesome, generally awesome. Alright, we got infinite money. Alright, we might as well buy some... Uh... This is not a cheat, by the way. I'm not cheating. Everything's fine. It's, it's in the game. It's just efficiency. It's roughly enough. You, you get the idea. We spent like two or three minutes doing that. Um... Let's try to do this uh, quest. So we're trying to go to the north east part of town. We've got a little, a little bit more of the town. Don't cause me any trouble. Once we uh, finish the town, we never have to really look at it again. Gresh Square. Talk to me. Talk to me. I'm the fastest gardener in Vashna Room. Yeah. Garden. More items. Got a Balu leaf. 
I don't remember what energy does uh, either. So we're gonna we're actually gonna kind of oh look at that. I like to collect spooky plants. Spooky plants. I shouldn't look in other people's dressers. I'm not going to click on absolutely everything. Was I in here? Yes. I will get that chest. I just want to talk to this girl. Hi, you must be Tony. I'm Trin. Nice to meet you. Wow, how do you know who I am? Aiden's only been here for a short time. Remedy drink? Another thing I don't know what it does, but we'll figure it out. We'll get it done. Eva gives me jelly beans for good grades, but I don't care because Pode gives me them for free. Pode was the big innkeeper, but I remember that. Russell, Russell, clink. Question marks? Remedy drink. Oh, the music is so cool. Here's the other old guy that we want. Owen told me to forget to tell you that he wants to speak to you. Owen told me... Oh, not to forget to tell me that he wants to speak to you. Oh, okay. I, I guess I have to go talk to... Uh, this is not the guy I was talking about. Northeast? You know, I went uh, I went northwest. I mixed them up. A lot of smart thing to do. Alright, let's go to... Uh... Let's check this out. Can I go in this door? It doesn't respond. It's just a door. What? Door in quotations. Balu leaf. Doesn't respond. It's just a fire. What are you doing to me? Wait, does the bed respond to me? I love this game. Can you tell? Alright. I gotta read everything. Performing soon. The famous jug band Pode and the ingredients. Okay. Here's a guard. How can I work this job one day at a time? Just like the rest of us. Here we go. No! I will not go through this again! But Orwin... No, Aiden! You think someone is Kairos every year? Let's see, who was it last year? Pode? What were you thinking? I could have sworn the food he cooked gave me superhuman strength. But this time... And before that was Yaki! We couldn't shut him up for months! He went around shouting, Oh yeah! I'm the Great Magic Kairos! Dig it! Woo! Okay, okay, I'm sorry. If you just listen, this time... Ah, oh, this must be the boy. Yes, Tony. I'd like you to meet Orwin, Elder of Vashnaroom. Nice to meet you. Yes, yes, so if you, you wish to get home, right? Where did you say you were from? Tavil Gorge. Tavil Gorge, hmm. I've been from here to Aroth and back, but that name doesn't ring a bell. Well, this is a dilemma. I'll try to figure out a way to get you home, but you must stay in town until then. I told you, I don't think he's from this world. Quiet, you! I need to think. So, what now? Well, I guess you'll just have to stay in town. We'll get you out of here soon enough. In the meantime, take your crystal to Pruitt, the ringsmith. If you get hungry, go see Pote at the inn. Alright, now I'm free to do what I want. I love the short cutscenes. Um, but we already met both of those people. And, uh, really think arcade. I don't know what this does. We're going to use it right now. I can't. Alright. It's locked. Oh, what does he say? What did he say? You should go visit. Oh, yeah. When I was younger, this town was... This, like, whole city was just giant for me. Whoa! What are you doing here, buddy? You have no things here. Okay. Don't follow Aiden on some foolish mission. You have one te line of text? Yeah. So yeah, we already ran into both Pode the Innkeeper and Pruitt the Ringsmith. So we're going to go visit Pruitt first. Yes. I know she's a Ringsmith because I played the game before, but they also gave me this really nice clue earlier. Talk to Pruitt. Is this the Ringsmith shop? 
Yes, it is. My name is Pruitt. How can I be of service? Hi, I'm Tony Jones. I was told by Aiden to show you this crystal. Hmm, let's see. Oh, this is some pretty good Furok Anamite. Furok Anamite? What do you mean? You don't know about Anamite? Shall I explain it to you? We're actually going to say, oh, by the way, in this game, it defaults all of the explanations to no, which is really badass. But, um... We're going to say yes just because of the play. Let's play. Well, Anamite is a kind of crystal. We use ordinary Anamite as money around here. So I can use this to buy stuff? No, no, no. Well, I mean, normally you could, but this is infused Anamite. What does that mean? Well, if you take infused Anamite and give it to me, I can make a ring for you, and that will allow you to control a dream creature. Dream creature? Is that what a Furok is? Right. You may have seen a few outside of town. Both the Anamite we use as money and infused Anamite come from dream creatures. But a dream creature does not produce Anamite unless it's been weakened. So you must first defeat one to get it. To do that, you need to use the dream creatures you have. I can help you get equipped with one if you need it. I guess it's lucky for me that I found this just lying around. It sure is! Lol. Well, since Aiden sent you, he probably wants me to make this into a ring for you. Be right back! So yeah, it's like Pokemon. You get the creatures, and you make rings, and you can summon them to fight for you. Here you go. Tony got a good Furok. So it says good. If I had um, gotten out of the cave like poorly, it would be like just an okay Furok or something. But if you go really, really far, you get like a great Furok. I don't know if it's level or just stats. But uh, there's a little Anamite left over. I really like to study this. So can I buy it from you for 50 Anamite? Sure. There's no option. You just get extra... Um, you get some money to kick you off, but I have 999 Anamite because they broke the game. Or I broke the game, I don't know. Show the ring to Evil, he'd be interested. Who's that? Evil's the historian, or when he can remember, you should go meet him. Okay, thanks. So, I'm gonna go over there, uh, but let's take a quick look at our Furok. It's under rings, this is how you can see your guys. So, now I remember. The, uh, you can see all the stats. He's level 3, has 11 strength, 10 defense, 3 speed, no experience currently, 7 skill, 7 resist, and 10 luck. And I think E is energy. Yeah, for him. Um, I love these little animations here. I can barely tell where everything is, but I can see there's a little bird on his horn. Um, you can see better when there's combat animations, what everything is, but we're going to equip him with Archaic Leaf. So left and right will show uh will like equip the different things so you equip these little question mark things to your uh your dream creatures and this is giving 10 skill i don't remember what all the stats do but i think it's kind of charming that i don't i just want to really quickly see if i unequip this does it show up in my items it does not and i have an ability apparently scratch that takes Oops, it takes five energy. I don't remember how many rings I can have on me at once. It's probably ten. I actually never thought about that when I was a kid, but you only have ten fingers anyways. Let's go visit the historian. Why, hello there, Poad. Would you like a cookie? Uh, I'm not. Where are my jelly beans? Excuse me, does the historian live here? Uh, yes, history. I dabbled once. Once, I remember when they made the blue jelly beans. Please don't let this guy be the historian. Let's start talking again. The red ones were the best. What's with this guy? He wants jelly beans? I guess it's an item quest. Yeah. <coughs> so we are going to, um... We're going to run. And find some jelly beans. Now... Because I did a little bit of uh, precursor of an exploration, we already know that uh, jelly beans are from this guy. Actually, I only happen to know that because I know this guy's name is Pode, the innkeeper. Unless Aiden said it, then all the clues are here. All travelers are welcome. No thanks. Well, at least have some of my jelly beans before you go. Tony got jelly beans. All right. That was simple. It doesn't show. Does it? Where do I? S There's no way to see. My quest items. I just have to remember I have them. Right? Yeah. Nothing in the select menu. A does nothing in town. B is run. Give Evie the jelly beans? 
They're mine. The red ones are the best. What's with this guy? He wants jelly beans? Okay, cool. That's really funny. It's absolutely just didn't do anything. Okay, share. Oh, munch, munch. Jelly beans. I feel so much better. Are you the historian? Yes, I am, young fellow. I am also a master spellcaster. Or I was. Actually, I've forgotten most of them. I remember one, though. Here, take the spell book. Yeah, I just gave it to a complete stranger. I got a leaf cut. I hope you can put that to good use. Go ahead, ask me anything. Oh, I can now ask about relics and stuff. Bali leaf. Bali leaf. Bali restores a little bit of your energy. I'm not going to do this voice for everything. Restores your energy. I guess it's more. All of the creature's ailments. Leaf cut. Leaf cut deals a little damage to an enemy. Okay. Relics. Okay. If I want to know what an item does, I need to come to this guy or find an equivalent in another town. Spoilers, there's more than one town. Uh, I got a Furok. I got other things. We are at 26 minutes. I can't control my character right now. So we're going to keep going until we get to a safe spot. And then we're going to save, and then we're going to, uh... We're going to, make a, we're going to have a break. Why are you so persistent? Even if he is the great Magus Kairos, we'd be better off sending him back to his world. Look, things have not been right lately. The dream creatures have been acting strange lately. Don't you understand what that means? Your stubbornness is going to be the end of this nation. We have to tell him the truth. I've heard enough, Aiden. I want you to leave Vashta room until all this blows over. Whoa! But I think that Gia would want to meet him. She's even able to... I forbid you to take him to this town. Imagine or not, the kid stays here. Oh, probably from this town. My word is final. Oh, I love how they just build the story in this game. I guess it's the, the narrative. Hmm. With the, the scene changes and stuff. I have no control of my character right now. Oh, Tony, I was just leaving for the weave. Uh, I see Pruitt made a fine ring for you. Yeah, she mentioned something about dream creatures and stuff. Tony, follow me. There's somebody who I want you to meet. Didn't Orin say I wasn't supposed to leave town? This is very important, trust me. Well, if you say so. Tony, I want you to have this. Tony got an Eldritch Awl. It will help you escape from dangerous areas. Do you know how to control the power of infused atomite? No, I don't. Nope. No, nope. Well, Yaki over there is the trainer of Vashnarum. Here, I'll introduce you. The trainer? What does he train for? Tony, I'd like you to meet Yaki. Yaki, meet Tony. Oh, yeah! How you doing, brother? I'm the guy that's gonna tell you how to nap those dream creatures and beat them senseless. Er, I mean, beat them and nap Woo! So, what you gotta do? I want to say that there is a secret in this game involving this giant head in the ground, and I'm gonna see if they can figure it out. Okay, tell me about... Okay, so I get to choose one of four things. Basics, action, tips, and hunting, so we're gonna try them all out. Oh yeah, that's the spirit. Okay, here's the basics. There are two kinds of battles you can get into. One is creature battle, and one is a magi battle. Creature battle is when you're just fighting dream creatures, so you can nab them. Magi battle is a duel between you and another magi. All battles happen turn by turn, and you get one, that's right, or just one action each turn. Each action takes some time to perform, so just watch it. What can I do? What can I do? I'll spare you the details for now, but the actions are focus, summon, spell, item, and run. How can I keep from getting hit? Basically, the creatures you summon take the damage for you. The only time you yourself take damage is when you don't have any creatures summoned, or if the opponent has a special ability to do that. I'm trying to read without with the, the pacing of the thing, but... And how do I win the fight? Oh yeah! That's easy! Beat down all those creatures, and you win, brother! And in Magi Battles, this includes the guy that's in control of the creatures, of course. Uh... Of course, if you and all your creatures get beat up, you lose. However, as long as you still have a creature summoned, you can be in the worst shape possible and still win. So don't give up. And when the fight's over, your creature's leftover energy will return to you. Whoa! Want to know anything else, brother? Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, wow, that's amazing. Oh, yeah! Okay, tell me about action. 
Okay, so now I can look at each of these actions. So summon. I'm not gonna do the voice. I can't. I can't. I, the first and most important action, brother, is summon. Oh yeah! There's only so much damage I can do by himself. So summoning creatures is the best way to attack your opponents and the best way to defend against them. So what can my creatures do for me? Lots of stuff! I wish that was just the end of it. Different creatures have different actions, and each turn, your creatures will do the action you tell them to do. They get one action per turn, like you. Sounds useful. But remember this next part! There are some downsides. For one, it takes some of your own energy to call one of these creatures. Second, you can only have out four creatures at a time. And third, creatures don't get to do any actions on the turn you summon them, so be careful, dude. Want to know anything else, brother? Oh yeah. Tell me about... I just... I just uh... Tips. We're just gonna do tips and that's it. Or right, and hunting. We're gonna watch your energy and don't drain yourself with spells if you don't have a good defense. Because if you and your creatures run out of energy, it's all over. Anything else? Don't be afraid to run if you don't if you have to. You don't get any reward for running away, but you would think about avoiding a huge beatdown that is not from Oh <laughs> Unfortunately, only you can you can only run from creature battles. Magic battles are honorable duels, so don't do anything cowardly or you'll be made fun of. Wanna know anything else, brother? Um, just want to see what the hunting is. A creature battle is easy to get into. Whenever some creatures are nearby, you'll see a burst of dream energy. Just run right into it and you'll find creatures. From there, you can do battle and try to nab them. Okay, so just to summarize really quickly. Oh yeah, dig it, woo! I think I've had enough of this guy. Alright, just to summarize really quickly. Um... There are two types of battles. I, I you, you saw it, whatever. We'll see when we get in there. There's no reason for it. Yeah. I'm Salafi, apprentice trainer. Ready for a training match? Yes, I am. Good. Let's go. All right. This is this is a lot. Of, like we should have just done this. So we're gonna start by summoning our Furok for 23 energy. Good. Now you have your creature fight with mine. Furok was summoned. Weebo was summoned. So I have 77 energy because it costs 23 for him. Uh, I don't want to use an item. I don't want to use a spell. I'm going to focus, which makes my energy go up. So I can summon more guys, possibly. And I'm going to use Scratch. And I can only target three things. This guy, or myself, Tony. My own Furok, which is kind of weird. And the Weebo. So I'm going to target the Weebo. There's no time on this, either. It's just turn-based. There's no, uh... It's not like a Final Fantasy real-time thing. So I focus for two energy... We will heal itself for two. Aw, oh, yeah. We was eliminated. I got four energy for the defeat. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um. Oh no, you got my Weebo. Now your creatures can attack me directly. Focus for one. Be like he's a scratch. Six damage. I'm just gonna keep focusing. And I'll just fight instead of using a um, my attack. So energy is also life, as far as I'm aware. So when your energy hits zero, that's it. So if you um, if you're taking a lot of damage, not only are you getting closer to death, but you can't cast spells and you can't summon guys. So, the more I hurt her, the less chance she has of being able to summon something as well. Damage to Magi is, like, the best. Tony wins. That was great. Come back anytime. I'll do that. Excellent. This must be where they store the training equipment. I never found out what's behind that door in my entire life. There may not be anything, but there's a door there. Um, as opposed to this, uh, or not as opposed, but in terms of this thing... Scary and big. There's a really tricky um, thing where you're supposed to run around at a certain number of times and the eye opens up. I don't know how to figure it out. I don't know how people figure it out. I'll get to it. We're done. Are you sure you've trained enough? Yes, I'm sure. Yep. Well, in that case... Huh? What's going on? I... I don't know. I think it's coming from the Glade. What's shaking, brother? What's shaking? Oh, look, I can still control myself. Oh, yeah, take it. Whoa! 
Oh no! Now, if I remember correctly, I can actually explore Elk Hand. Aiden, what in blazes is going on? What are you asking me for? I don't know. And you have the boy with you. Or any the boy with you? I can't do it. It's coming from the the glade. I will deal with you later. I'm not a professional voice actor. If it's problematic, just let me know, and I'll just read normal voices for everybody and like girl voices for the girls, and that's it. Otherwise, I'm just gonna keep doing whatever. Aiden, what's going on? I was eating lunch, and the quake made me fall right off my chair. All the old guys have the same voice. And I just saw Owen running through town like a madman. Where's she going in such a hurry? This isn't good. Let's go see what's going on. Oh, uh, yeah, this is where I'm able to go back into town. Uh, I'm not going to right now. This has already been half an hour. Okay, we are going to save right here. And call it an episode for now. I'm going to see you guys next time.